Hey everybody, welcome back to the Cal and Rich Show. My name is Cal and this is my very funny husband, Rich. <laughs> I didn't do a thing. I didn't do a thing. <laughs> Thanks for being here, you guys. The fun. This is the, this is where we're at right now. We're, <laughs> we're having some fun, doing some fun music. Jim Croce, Roller Derby Queen. Hello. Uh, I'll let you know about the actual song facts, uh, why Jim wrote this, what his inspiration was. If you don't know, it's kind of funny. Um, so Kel knows Time in a Bottle, uh, Operator, Bad by Leroy Brown. Yes. Um, this one, not so much, and she actually has never heard it at all, not even the hook, not even the uh, anything about it. So I figured, you know, Spanish Train from Krista Berg, we did that the other night. That, that, was, that, was, that was great. And we've done some other really awesome kind of ballads, power ballads, and just, you know, the, the Mr. Blue Sky kind of idea with ELO. That's right in her wheelhouse. She loves that I stuff. Love and Mr. the more Blue Sky. the more melodic, the more fun. Yeah. That's in her wheelhouse. It's not for everybody and you can click click move on whatever you want to do. But uh, that's what we're doing right here and we're doing some live performances this week and just really spreading it out a little bit, not not being uh, very predictable and you know, I'm sure you clicked on this and went, "Jim Croce, what?" But, you know, Americana and early 70s passes away in plane crash right at the top of his career just yeah. boom just gone just like that i mean janice joplin jim morrison Jimi hendrix i mean just all all just passing away in that in that era and yeah. um and people going why what's going on and did you know about the whole age 27 thing check out which rockers died at age 27 just do a little google search i won't give it away here give you something else to do amazing yeah. I'll Amazing. Have to look that 27 up. years old seems to be the magic number. I'll give you a hint. Kurt Cobain, Janis Joplin. We can keep going. All 27 years old. That's so young. Oh my God. 27. So. So young. All right. So if you want to make a request, go to our website, www.knr.wtf. Look us up on Facebook under Richard Gafter. We'll friend you as long as you send us a messenger kind of note saying who you are. And on our homepage, You'll see it's designed a little bit differently. It's a little clearer now. On the very right, you'll see the request engine. Fill your song requests in there. And then you'll see the Ask Kel and Rich tab on the top. That's where you can actually ask us a question. We'll we'll answer your question on the air. Please, no song requests in the Ask Kel and Rich area. It's not going to happen. We're just going to delete it. We're just going to delete it. We just have so much to go through, and we're trying to get to what really matters here. And some of those questions are pretty cool, and we want to get to those. And... You know, we can only have so many hours in the day here. So uh, that's a bit of the housekeeping. And there's one more thing. Forbidden videos <laughs> are on the website, okay? So it gets her every time. I love it. She even asks for it now. We'll be like at the kitchen table. She'll be like, just do it, do it, do it. <laughs> Forbidden videos. So you'll click on our website and you'll see on the little tag cloud, kind of halfway down the page where all that there's some random band names in alphabetical order. Those are the ones that we've done posted on the website. So make sure you click on those. And um, under F is you do it. No, you do it. No, you do it. No, no, you're better. Forbidden videos. (laughs) No, it's got to be the forbidden videos. Yeah, she did it. (laughs) Okay, and that's the ones that are having a little harder time being posted up on Facebook, on, um, on YouTube. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, wh- while you're on our website, if you're on YouTube also, uh, just check out what the sponsors are all about, okay? It's a way you can support them. It's a way you can support yeah. us. It doesn't reach into anybody's pocket at all. All right, enough okay. housekeeping. We have to tell you or else you'd never know. And some people are brand new. Yeah. And so for those of you that are like, okay, guys, change. we've heard it over and over and over again, there's some people who it's their first time clicking on us. So yeah. if yeah. you're new, welcome. And if you've been here before, glad you're back. There we go. This is very exciting. I all love right. spending the whole day doing this with this you. This is awesome. All afternoon, all evening. Sun is shining. And Three, the music's playing. Two. Oh, one. I'm going to tell you a story that you won't believe. But I fell in love last Friday evening with the girl I saw on the barroom TV screen. Well, I was just getting ready to get my hat when she caught my eye and I put it back and I ordered myself a couple of more shots and beers. 
She was built like a refrigerator with a head. Her fans called her Tuffy, but all her buddies called her Spike. The night that I fell in love with a roll of Debbie Queen, around and round, all round and round. The meanest hunk of woman that anybody ever seen. Down in the arena. But to fall in love with this heavy duty woman I've been speaking of Things were kind of bad until the day she skated into my life But she might be nasty, she might be fat But I never met a person who could doubt her that She's my bleach blonde mama, my heavy-handed haggis like mama Ooh, Shout out for Jersey The night that I've been in love with a roll of Derby Queen Hunger woman that anybody ever seen down in the arena. Whew. Very fun. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Oh man. Just... That was some awesome guitar. Yeah, and just the production of it right just the the sound just of it sound 1973 simple. that's awesome yeah. yeah thank you yeah yeah yeah, yeah i have huge respect for him yeah. musically yeah he, he 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 could write some songs so so check this out kel this is just uh, from, from song from song facts uh as croce explained on his album the final tour this is a song about a woman jim met doing a gig at a local country and western bar as they sat and drank together he came to find out she used to be in the roller derby and that her husband was a state trooper he described her as being about 400 pounds saying quote every time i watched her clap i could see the hat on her arm jiggling back and forth it was a beautiful sight nice nice touch jim he also pointed out her penchant for hairspray and how he would see her t uh, toting cans of hairspray back from the supermarket. That's funny. Croce also explained that he wouldn't play the song locally as her husband could, quote, really mess up a nice day. <laughs> Croce often made up elaborate stories in his songs that were based on real but often eccentric people. Bad Bad Leroy Brown. That's fun. Etc. Very cool. There you go. So there's a little... That's not, fun. Not obscure Jim Croce, but um, yeah, kind of cool. And... What we're going to do next is um, we're going to do lyrically probably of this style of, of composition, my favorite song ever. Hmm. And it's, it's not a well-known song at all. It's called Age by Jim Croce. Okay. And so if you guys wanted to, uh, be, if you're curious about kind of getting to know me better and what kind of makes me tick, um, the, the lyrics in this song kind of really moved me from a very young age. Um, I was lucky enough to get my hands on one of these uh, records, and it wasn't even an A track. This was a record, and um, even from a young age, they hit me. So we'll see what uh, what Kel thinks. I can't wait. Yeah, so we're coming back to do that one. Okay. All right. Cool. Well, let's go. Well, thanks, Kel. Very fun. <laughs> Thank you. So you, man, can you imagine writing that song today? Some of the lyrics, it's like no, can't say shaming, some of that fat stuff. shaming, and all that stuff. No. It's like ugh, different time, different era. But mm -hmm. hey, you know, if it's if it's said all with, uh, I guess, good intent, um, whatever was going on in his mind when he wrote that, uh, he justified it some way, and it's still plays today. All right. Later, everyone. See you soon. Bye. Bye bye.